Hey, what's up, my name? Let's talk about 15 ways to make exercise a part of your everyday life. So there is no way around it. Living a sedentary life is described as sitting more than four hours a day, whether at work or at home. When you realize this, you note right away that most people, with a few exceptions, are easily living a sedentary life if they don't find a way to intentionally move more. Thankfully, you need only walk about 15 minutes every four hours to reduce the effects of that lifestyle. You can do that by using these ways to make exercise part of your everyday life. If you haven't met before, my name is Jen Blake, and your holistic empowerment coach, team from Business Tech to Authentic Thrive. Make sure you like, subscribe, follow, so you get relevant information right to you anytime that I put it up. So number one, park in the back. When you drive, don't park the near, near, near the near, nearest entrance. Instead, park as far as way as you can so that you can, feel, as you feel safe, that is. That way it forces you to walk those extra steps every time you need to get to your car. Two, walk instead of ride. Whenever the weather is good and the distance, it takes less than an hour, I would say, try walking. Walking is just one hour at a moderate pace of about three to five miles per hour can get you beyond where you may think. Three, ride your bike. If you don't want to walk or you'd like to change it up, start riding your bike instead of driving. Many cities now have bike lanes and paths to make it a lot simpler to do that. Four, do what you enjoy. Find activities that require movement that you like doing. There are so many things to choose from that there is no real reason to do things that you hate. If you don't like running, don't do it. Maybe you like rock climbing or hiking or dancing instead. Five, get your friends involved. The more people that do things with you actively, the better. You'll enjoy the activity more and more when you hang around with healthy people. So find your healthy people. You're more likely to be healthy too. Six, challenge yourself. Some Sometimes it's fun to give yourself a little bit of a challenge to meet. For example, you can have a challenge to run a marathon by joining one of the of the couch to 5k groups right or it could be like yoga you can enroll in a yoga te- in teacher training in order to challenge yourself to do more i became a yoga instructor so i would actually do yoga seven reward yourself when you set a goal for yourself and achieve it you should find a way not food to reward yourself for it remember to make your rewards healthy not food you don't reward yourself with fries for hard work e- eating right for example okay don't do it Eight, don't compare yourself with others. There is no reason ever to look at someone else, else's fitness level or desire and judge yourself harshly. You are you. They are them. And you're great You're great the way you are. Number nine, take the stairs anytime you're comfortable with stairs versus the elevator. Take the stairs, whether up or down. The more you do, this is the better for you in general not to mention the booty. Number 10, take an after dinner walk. Studies show walking at a moderate pace for just 20 minutes after a rich dinner reverses the effects of that dinner on your cardiovascular system. Plus, it keeps you from snacking. Number 11, march or dance while watching TV. Oh yes, if you want to watch a lot or little TV and shows every day, right? Instead of just sitting to watch a movie while watching, You can march, dance, ride a stationary bike, and not miss a thing. Number 12, stand when talking on the phone calls. Don't sit down while you're talking on the phone. Instead, you know, pace. The more you pace while talking, the more it is worth to talk, the more on the phone, right? You have reason to talk. 13, invest in sit-stand desk. I have one right here. If you have a sedentary job or a desk job, you can find out if you can get your company to provide you with a sit-stand desk or create one. Mine's, mine's actually kind of a little self-created. By adding a shelf, that enables you to stand, okay? And I have a stepper as well right by it. Play more, number 14, play more with kids and pets. Even if you don't have kids or pets yet, find some to play with. Playing and running around without any goals is a wonderful way to burn energy and get more exercise and feel happy. Kids make you happy, right? You can always volunteer with a shelter or big brothers or big sisters. So many opportunities. 15, 
be less productive. Yes, I said, instead of sending an email to your coworker, walk to another office, walk to the break room, walk to the printer, and be less efficient so you can move more often. The thing to get clear on is that it doesn't take much to really make an impact on your health. Moving more just 30 minutes a day at a brisk pace combined with a healthy balanced diet is enough to help you reduce the risk of disease later on in life. And that's truth. So this is 50 ounce minutes. Do you have a tip that I missed that you think should be in here? Go and put it in the comments and let everybody know what's one of the, your things that you do or that you think is your, you've heard maybe me or someone else talk about that should be in here or which one of these are you going to start doing? Go and comment below. You never know. I hand out free stuff all the time. You might just be chosen and be shot, shot for a shout out and for some, some free stuff. So, um, once again, like, subscribe, follow if you don't, so you get um, alerted any time that I bring relevant information for your fit lifestyles and it's doable, sustainable, lasting, and realistic. If you're ready for that 180, if you need to do a different way, if you've been losing in the weight loss game, you're ready for real results and real success, make sure you check the show notes and send me a direct message anywhere on any platform I'm on or through the email that's there and set up your free 60-minute empowerment coaching call so that we can create a plan for you that you can actually implement and it's going to take you through the journey to begin to live that fit lifestyle and something that you can implement and that's not going to cause you stress anxiety it's those these simple things that if we do it's going to create those lasting changes okay so if there's any way i can serve you help you please let me know um i love your questions please continue to submit your questions so that i can answer them um i'm proud of you um be brave be kind, live authentically, and always try to remember you're just one habit away, and that you matter, you're important, you're worth this, and you're not going to fail, not this time, this time you will succeed. And I'm going to cheer you on every step of the way. All right, until next time, tribe.